So this is what I got done doing. I just got done cutting the rotors for the front on the Grand Marquis and painting the calipers, the bracket, um, cleaning off any spots that I've seen that may need some kind of attention. And I went with the CVPI Severe Duty brake pads. Tomorrow I am going to do the rears and just go ahead and knock them out while I'm here as well. But that's the update for right now on the Cherry, 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 Cherry 2007 Mercury Grand Marquis garage find. It's been sitting for years with only 26,000 miles. So um, the rim guy did come today. He just got done back there in that corner out those doors over yonder, way yonder by the trees. I seen him out there just a little bit ago. He just got done powder coating a set of F-150 rims and I asked him what I need to do to get my factory Grand Marquis rims redone by them. And he said that uh, I would need to contact his boss. His boss will send him back out here and he will pick them up and it will be a couple weeks turnaround, but it's about 125 to $150 a rim to refinish to factory condition. So I'm just gonna have him go ahead and do it. That both sides done. Still had the factory Motocraft brakes and rotors on it. The old brakes had 60, 70% pad life. I just don't know whether or not to trust them, you know. Uh, just the fact that they've been on here for so long and I'm with my family in this thing. So I'm like, you know what? I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna do what I think is right. And I'm gonna go through it and, and change everything kind of like while I'm there. So I figured I would uh, try the severe duty CVPI front pads we had those in stock the rears they said they discontinued so they gave me um, not the economy motocraft brand for the rear they gave me the better ones the, the regular the factory style semi-metallic I'm just gonna go with those for now but they said they uh, had the rear CVPI severe duty is obsolete we cannot get them so they gave me the next best thing, which is you have the economy line and then the OEM line. I said, I want the OEM line. If that's the case, then I'll just put the OEM ones back on the rear. So that's where we're at with this right now is uh, just slowly picking away at it. You know, a lot of people coming by today looking at it and they haven't seen it because I just came back from vacation and stuff. And a lot of people are like, wow, man, would you put it on the lot to sell it? Would you trade it in? No, 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 no. I'm keeping it. This girl ain't going nowhere. She will infinitely be mine unless somebody came out with some outstanding amount of money that I just could not walk away from. So, uh, it is what it is. I'll let y'all know.